Hello! We're here to talk to you today about acids and bases. Bill Nye the Science Guy! Bill Nye the Science Guy! Bill! 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 Bill Nye the Science Guy! Science rules! Bill Nye the Science Guy! Inertia is a property of matter. Bill! 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 Bill. Acids are often sour and are usually found in citrus fruits. Bases are usually bitter and can feel slippery and are found in common household cleaners. The acidity of most chemicals is measured on a pH scale which range, ranges from 1 to 14. Less than 7 indicates an acid and above 7 indicates a base. According to the Bronsted-Lowry definition, a base is any chemical that accepts a hydrogen ion, aka a proton, and an acid is any chemical that donates a hydrogen ion, aka a proton. There's a simple trick to remembering this with the simple acronym BAD. Bases accept and acids donate. BAD. H3O, or a hydronium ion, is made by adding a proton to a water molecule. OH, or hydroxide, is made by removing a hydrogen ion, aka a proton, from an H2O molecule. Did you know that there's acids and bases in your own home? I did, in fact. And look, we have some right here. Do we? We do. Let's test it and see if it's an acid or a base. All right. Get your pH strip, and we'll test it. Oh, according to our pH level Insta check, our Greenworks Clorox product is pH level 11, meaning that it is a fairly strong base. Wow, that's fascinating. Let's go find other things around the house that we can test for pH levels. Let's go. Look, dog water. AKA tap water. Let's test its pH level. Oh, our InstaCheck tells us that the dog water is a pH level 6, slightly acidic, as most tap water should be. Ooh, how about we test clear ammonia, all-purpose household cleaner? Looks like it has a pH 11. Basic! Boy, I'm awfully parched. Oh, well, look at these testable objects. While I'm here quenching my thirst, I might as well test them for their pH levels. Lemonade is pH level 5. I'm feeling slightly acidic! Next up, milk. Crap. <laughs> Wait, I'll get it. That darn surface tension broke and I can't find it now. It's probably like disintegrated now. Oh, wait, okay. <laughs> oh, I was. Wait, oh, it's actually rather neutral. It is actually very close on our Insta check to pH level 7. I'm feeling a little less acidic now. 
Have you ever had a cold or a flu? Well, if you have, you've probably taken NyQuil. The aches, fever, sore throat, sneezing, runny nose, cough, best sleep you ever had with a cold medicine, which you have to be 18 to buy. And if you're like me, you've probably wondered what its pH was. Well, that's what I'm here for. It appears to have a pH of 3. Very acidic. Fun fact! Most people think that only asses burn your skin, but actually, bases can too. Now, let's test some local stream water. It has a pH of 6, slightly acidic, contrary to popular belief. Just because water is acidic doesn't necessarily mean that it's bad. In fact, most natural water ranges from 5 to 7 on the pH scale. By definition, acidic water is only pH less than 5. Only then does it become dangerous.